Hey, this is Andy with IT Supplies. If you've been watching our channel, you already know how much I love the Epson V7000 for its versatility, value, and quality. Today, we're gonna to take a look at one of the highest quality and highest margin applications, acrylic prints. We're gonna show you the settings we use for our acrylic prints, we'll put a stopwatch on the prints, and we'll show you the beautiful quality you can achieve with the Epson V7000. Acrylic prints are a vibrant, modern way to decorate a wall or space. The high gloss finish and the three-dimensional depth of the image is really striking. When you see a quality acrylic print, you understand why customers are willing to pay such a high price to put them on their walls. For years, photo labs and print providers have been producing beautiful acrylic prints through a painstaking process. The traditional acrylic print is done by printing to a photo paper with an inkjet or silver halide printer. Once that print is done, it is face mounted to a piece of acrylic using an optically clear adhesive. This sounds pretty simple, but in reality, it's very challenging. The printed paper needs to be married to the acrylic without any dust coming between the paper and the acrylic. The laminate needs to be applied perfectly, and the print can't become dented or kinked, or you will see it in the finished product. The acrylic needs to be cut to size, and the excess paper needs to be trimmed from the back of the acrylic without any tearing. This process is unforgiving and very time consuming, not to mention the care that has to be given to building and maintaining a clean room without any dust. When you factor in how much expertise and patience is required to make traditional acrylic prints, it's no wonder that they are sold at a very high margin. Today, we're gonna to show you how the Epson V7000 can produce stunning acrylic prints in an easy one-step process. Printing on acrylic with a UV flatbed printer is not a brand new concept. Sign makers and decorators have been doing this for years. But the real high-end photo work has always been reserved for the traditional face mounting process because of its superior quality. But not anymore. Now, there is a UV flatbed printer made by the leading innovator in the photographic market. With its nine color ink set, variable droplet technology, and intelligent print head configuration, the V7000 is capable of making the highest quality acrylic prints in a single step. That's enough talking, let's show you how easy it is to make a beautiful acrylic print with the Epson V7000. The first step is to spend hours creating a neutral and accurate ICC profile for your acrylic. Or, you can use the included and available profile that Epson has made for you called Transparent Acrylic Board. We're going to take the easy path today and use Epson's stock profile. Epson offers several quality modes to choose from when printing on acrylic. In our testing, we found that the mode called Quality offered the best speeds while still maintaining excellent image quality. This mode prints at 720 by 1080 resolution. It's really important that you select unidirectional mode when printing photo quality acrylic prints. This instructs the printhead to only lay down ink when moving in one direction and provides the most precise drop placement. Now we're gonna print a 16 by 24 inch piece of acrylic and put a stopwatch on the print time. Acrylic comes with a dust protection liner that we'll pull immediately before putting the piece on the printer. This doesn't give dust time to collect between the acrylic and the printed ink. You don't need a special clean room built to produce acrylic prints with the Epson V7000. Okay, so we have our finished acrylic print. There's no curing time, no lamination needed, and no post-process finishing. What you saw was the entire process. It took us eight minutes and 21 seconds to print this 16 by 24 inch piece of acrylic. When you compare to the steps involved in traditional face-mounted acrylic prints, I think you'll agree that this is a much quicker and easier process that can be produced at scale with very minimal labor costs. Printing with the Epson V7000 is quicker and easier, but how does the quality compare? Take a look at the pieces that we've printed and see for yourself. We know it's hard to get a sense for print quality in a video, so we would love to have you send us some of your files so that we can print them on acrylic and send them back to you to review. Better yet, we'd love to host you in our Chicagoland Demo Center so that you can help us run these test prints and see just how easy the process is. To request samples off the Epson V7000 or to schedule a demo, please visit us at our website at itsupplies.com. I hope you found this video helpful. If so, please give us a like and leave us a comment below. If you'd like to see more videos covering the Epson V7000, check out our previous videos and subscribe to our channel so that you're alerted when we post new videos. Thanks for stopping by.